I love this show. It's fantastic. It really is. And the thing is, you know the industry inside out, so you are perfectly placed to be a judge. I do. I've, I, I'm really lucky to be a judge, actually, yeah. on this show. It's, so, it's, it's really good, and I've been a fan for a long time. Yeah, me too. I used to love the American one as well, with Tyra Banks. I know. Yeah, it's really good. I know, it's, <laughs> it's really good. A little crazy. Uh, absolutely crazy. But actually, we've got... Um, it's nice on this show, because we've got a bit more fun stuff. It's not it. just about how they look, is it? It's not about that. No, not, not at all. Obviously, they've got to look beautiful or, or interesting. They have to look beautiful and interesting, and, and this is what we said to the girls. Um, there's a whole illusion about you can have an Instagram page and you look really good on there mm. um, but when they come a lot of them when they come to the challenges they're completely mystified of what they have to do you know when I first started I, I was in Milan and I lived there for six months and it was literally sort of hand-to-mouth knocking on doors sure. seeing people walking for them doing jobs and you don't get paid a lot in the beginning mm. unless you really have a lucky break right so I think um, everyone thinks like what you said it's champagne and red carpets yeah. which at some point it is but behind the scenes, it's hard work. Yeah, but to get to that point, <clears> you've actually got, you know, <throat> it is getting up at three o'clock in the morning. It yeah. is going through all that rejection because that's part of the job as well. And I think that, again, you know, it's all very well having a pretty face, but you've got to have the strength of character to cope with the fact that people will just take one look at you, they don't know you, and they'll just go, no. It's true. Well, I, I, I'm going to be horrible. But that happens all the time. It does all the time. And you're not going to be right for every job. No, of course not. You know, you might be blonde or brunette and it's going to be different, you know? Yeah, exactly. You wanted to be a boxer when you were a kid. I, that was a, been crazy. I was a little boxer. You were, yeah, look, there you are, and you're an award winning boxer. <laughs> oh my as well. gosh, look that's an old you. picture. I know, but the thing is, you can't have continued boxing. It would have ruined your beautiful face. Not when you're hiding. But I suppose it depends how good you are, doesn't it? It does, exactly. <laughs> if nobody can yeah. get to you. Well, it's a good sport. A lot of the guys actually do do boxing, and it's come quite popular with the girls absolutely, as well. Absolutely, absolutely. Well, we had Nicola on the Olympic gold medal winning boxer on yesterday, and she was saying how she's she looks amazing. amazing isn't she's she? got a really good form. She is she's fantastic. a good boxer. She's great. She's really good. And you're right, it's a great way to keep fit. Because you have to take care of yourself. I do. No, you have to do all of that. I do. Yeah. And what do, you, do you still box, or, do you, or what do you well, do? I do. I box train. Yeah. And I, and I do. Uh, um, I do a martial art as well. Right, OK. But, uh, and where's home now? Where London. is home? London is definitely home. Yeah. I moved, back to, I moved back about a year and a half ago. I was in New York for two years and LA mm. for five years. Because you did the whole LA thing. Movies, TV, dating Jennifer Aniston. Can't even say her name. Jennifer <laughs> Aniston, who's married now, of course. And Cameron Diaz. You did yeah. all that. You lived the dream. Well, it was, it, was, it was a nice time. It was a really good time in my yeah, life. Yeah, very well. Um, I kind of tottered out there just for a diff bit of a different lifestyle, you know? And, um, and it was a really good time. I loved my time out there, but I really miss London. Yeah, London is home. But look, we're going to see you tonight, aren't we? We are. Lifetime, 9 o'clock. It's going to be a great launch from there. Excellent. Absolutely. Good, good. And you enjoyed it? You enjoyed the whole experience? Oh, I, I loved it, because when I, when I got spotted and, and uh, won a competition with Select. Ah. And that's how I started. Right. So I can really relate to the girls and what they're going to go through for this whole Exactly. You can period. give them lots and lots of experience, lots of mentoring. And when the time is right, you know, you can also... Because some of them do sometimes need to be told, oi, you know. I'm not afraid of that. We said that. Everyone's asking what kind of judge are you? Are you a mm. good judge, bad judge? I know I say I'm the honest one. If you're, if you're not pulling your weight, I'll tell you. Exactly. If you're brilliant, you're brilliant. Excellent. Well, you're brilliant. Thank you, Paul. Thank Thanks you very much indeed.